Hello, drink of choice, a cheeky little Malbec. Oh, that's got some depth. Today we're using this carrot and coriander soup to make this chicken boona. Look at that. Okay. Here's all the ingredients. As usual, the link, link to the WISC website below. Uh, all the ingredients and full instructions are there. And also below the description, there is a full list of ingredients as well. So we'll start off with the ingredients. Firstly, our chicken breast, whoever this is. This is just one, cut into bite-sized cubes. I will wash my hands. Next, we've got some methyl leaves, cumin seeds, half an onion, finely chopped. And when I say finely chopped, I mean finely chopped. In here, we've got some coriander, which has been finely chopped. Also, we've got some green finger chilies. These are optional. One green onion, sorry, half a green onion. Again, little tiny cubes. In here, we have tomatoes. These are small tomatoes. I've cut them into eights, which is that big. I want them to melt into the gravy. Then I've cut them in quarters, which will be a bit of a garnish at the end. Uh, in here, I've got some uh, tomato paste mixed with warm water. I've got some salt, turmeric, coriander, uh, cumin, uh, garam masala, some mild madras curry powder and some chilli powder. Again, your chilli is optional, adds the heat. If you don't want the heat, leave it out if it's for kids. And that's it. Let's get cooking. So we start by adding some oil to our pan. Get a bit of oil in there, about two tablespoons. And then we're going to add in our cumin seeds. Going to cook them down in the oil, flavour the oil. Once they start popping, we're going to add in our onions and peppers. So as you can hear, they're popping now. So what we're going to do is add in our onions and peppers. Next goes in our garlic and ginger paste. They're nice and soft. Then cook a little bit, let the onions get nice and soft. Right there, nice and soft now. We're gonna add in our methy leaves and all the rest of the spices. This is gonna create your masala base. And what we're gonna to have to do, we're probably gonna to have to add some of this uh, tomato paste with water, stop the uh, spices from burning. Gonna add half of that in. Now we'll add the rest. Keep that cooking, burn it down. Now we're going to add in our chicken. Get that coated in all them spices and tomato, onions. So let's start cooking straight away. So we don't have to worry about them uh, drying out. Uh, 
This smells amazing, by the way. Look at that. Should let that cook a little bit. Good turning on. Now we're going to add in our salt. Mix it up. In with our coriander. These are mainly coriander stalks with a little bit of coriander leaves, so the bottom half of the uh, coriander stalks hold more flavour. Now, with those cutting down, we're going to add in our smaller. Bits of tomato, so I'll take the quarters out. We got these in. And also, the pièce de résistance, our coriander, coriander soup. Coriander and coriander really means garlic and coriander soup. You know, you see this looks amazing. Bit more. It's about half a tin. That's all you need. And as you can see, or oh, you will see in a second when I show you. This just looks. Look at that. Smell. So I'm going to add a little bit of hot water to that. You need it to be hot because you don't want to cool everything down. So I'm going to add about, I don't know, 100 ml of water. That's just going to let things cook evenly without the sauce evaporating. Now we just let that simmer on a medium heat. We're going to let that uh, water evaporate and start sticking a little bit. And again, it's up to you what you want to do. If you want the sauce thinner, add a bit more water. If you want it thicker, then reduce a bit longer. Just keep leaving it and stirring it every now and again. Right, it'll come back. As with more sauces, as the water evaporates, it caramelizes around the edge of your pan. So make sure you give that a good scrape. That also helps to thicken up the sauce. This one's been going for about five minutes now and it's starting to thicken up really nicely. I like my sauce to very, very thick. So we'll cook this for a bit longer. Just keep scraping it every now and again. Get all that caramelised goodness off the edges. And we'll be back. Right, this is almost there now. So we're going to add in our green chilies. Like I said, they're optional. And we're going to add in a good handful of coriander. Some colour. Give that a bit of a stir. And then our tomato quarters. I think that is ready to play. Look at that goodness. Let's pick the bad boy up. Let's clean this up. Go rice in. And then this wonderful tuna.
Look at that. All that sauce, lovely naan bread dipping into that. Oh. Is that not just glorious? Tomato shown there. Chili. And then let's finish it off with a little sprinkling of coriander. There we are, our delicious chicken boner. And the most important bit, the taste test. Oh, good. Mm. You must try this one. As always, please comment below. Let me know what you think of it when you've tried it. Heat of the chili start to come through now. Follow, subscribe, share, click the links. Please share and tell all your friends about this. Any recipes you want, let me know and I'll have a go at making them. But for now, Hmm, I'll see you later.